once told a contestant on Celebrity Apprentice it would be a pretty picture to see her on her knees. Brandy came in here, she got down on her knees and said, I am passionately want to do this. I, at this point, am the team chooser, not the team leader Excuse yet. Excuse me, you dropped to your knees. Yes. And begged to do this. And I said, I'm looking around the room. And it must he was be a right. pretty picture you dropped John into your and knees. Dennis thought I should be. Omarosa said me. I think Ivanka would do that inside the magazine, although she does have a very nice figure. I've said that if Ivanka weren't my daughter, perhaps I'd be dating her. You know? <laughs> Stop it. Oh, it's so weird. Stop You know what? You <laughs> are sick. Yeah. Isn't that terrible? Yeah. The hot well, interview last week in Rolling Stone magazine, Donald Trump said the following about you. Quote, look at that face. Would anyone vote for that? Can you imagine that, the face of our next president? Well, Rosie O'Donnell's disgusting. I mean, both inside and out. When you look at her and when you see the mind, the mind is, is weak. I don't see it. I don't get it. I never understood. How does she even get on television? If I were running The View, I'd fire Rosie. I mean, I'd look her right in that fat, ugly face of hers. I'd say, Rosie, you're fired. Rosie's a person that's very lucky to have her girlfriend. And she better be careful or I'll send one of my friends over to pick up her girlfriend. Why would she stay with Rosie if she had another choice? The Pew Research, which is independent, Don't says... Don't be naive. You're a very naive person. <laughs> the Pew You're Research a... says that there are, for immigrants on the whole, create... Or, Come on, try getting it out. Try getting it out. I'll get it out. I mean, I don't know if you're going to put this on television, but you don't even know what you're talking about. Try getting it out. Go ahead. Immigrants commit less crime than U.S. born citizens. I'd like to take some money out of her fat ass pockets. Thank you. For the record, it was well beyond Rosie O'Donnell. Yes, I'm sure it was. You're, you've called women you don't like fat pigs, dogs, slobs, and disgusting animals. Your Twitter account Only has Rosie several... O'Donnell. Does that sound to you like the temperament of a man we should elect as president? And how will you answer the charge from Hillary Clinton, who is likely to be the Democratic nominee, that you are part of the war on women? I haven't started with Hillary yet. What happened to her? I'm watching the debate, and she disappeared. Where did she go? Where did she go? I, I know where she went. It's disgusting. I don't want to talk about it. No, it's too disgusting. Don't say it. It's disgusting. Let's not do it. Even a race to Obama. She was going to beat Obama. But she was going to beat. She was favored to win. And she got schlung. What I say is what I say. And honestly, Megan, if you don't like it, I'm sorry. I've been very nice to you, although I could probably maybe not be based on the way you have treated me. But I wouldn't do that. Talk about Megan Kelly because you, you brought her up. Um, she did push you, pushed a lot of people. But what is it with you and Megan Kelly? Well, I just don't respect her as a journalist. I have no respect for her. I don't think she's very good. I think she's highly overrated. So I have, uh, you know, she she gets out and she starts asking me all sorts of ridiculous questions. And, you know, you could see there was blood coming out of her eyes, uh, blood coming out of her wherever. But uh, she was, uh, in my opinion, she was... Uh, off base. Let's take a let's hey, take a look a at. lightweight. I couldn't care less. Do you believe in punishment for abortion? Yes or no? Is a principle. Uh, the answer is that there has to be some form of punishment for the woman. Yeah, there has to be some form.